Hi everybody. Welcome back. This is Denise again. Welcome back to my D. Rogers channel for Operation Christmas Child. I'm going to do an unboxing today and this is for a boy two to four. One thing I wanted to mention is I did visit four different Walmarts yesterday in an attempt to look for clearance and most of the stores were wiped out and I'm convinced that they just packed things up for the following year. I'm not sure what happened, but I was able to get some things, but it took four stores and pretty much all day. I actually took off work yesterday um, to make a trip. So I hope that you had some success. There were no stuffed animals. I will tell you a little tip that I use when you're looking for stuffed animals after a holiday is go to the toy section and look in the stuffed animals there. Look in the baby department, random shelves. Sometimes you will find things and I was lucky enough to find some Christmas stuffies and some Valentine stuffies left over. Go figure. But um, that's just a little tip. Sometimes I get very lucky. So um, let me do my unboxing. This is for a boy two to four. And I have this thick rubber band. This is a number, I think they're number seven, number eight rubber bands. I order these on Amazon. They're really thick, they're really nice, and they really keep a box together. I used to use multiple rubber bands, and I don't have to do that anymore. I just use one. So when you open, he opens his box up. This is a, um, a theme for a train, train theme for boy two to four. You will see that his lid is decorated and it says you are loved and this is just a, um, a card that I got from Dollar Tree and um, it was a train and I was able to cut the back actually the verse is on the other side so I just flipped it over and I use a spray adhesive to spray these down and the letters I do tape down because they do come up if you don't put something down on top of them so the first thing on top he has a backpack And this is a small backpack I got from Target, and I think it was 30 cents, 90% uh, clearance uh, last year. And then one fell out was a pair of scissors, blunt edge. Uh, I got these for, I think they were two for 25 cents this summer at Walmart on their um, back to school clearance. And on top he has this Etch-a-Sketch and I think I got this at Dollar Tree for a dollar. I used to love Etch-a-Sketch when I was little so those are, I love those. Uh, okay he has a shirt and I got this cute train shirt from Old Navy and I actually got this during COVID. I forget, well we're still in COVID but um, when we were on complete lockdown, I did a purchase online and then a curbside pickup. And I don't remember the price, but it was pretty inexpensive. And I just loved it. I thought it was perfect for this box that I had been planning. And then to go with this shirt, he has a pair of sweatpants. I got these at Walmart for a dollar. These are Granimals. And then he has this really cute Winnie the Pooh Beanie Baby. So cute. Engineer. And this was one of those Beanie Babies that I told you about in my other video that I had um, picked up from a lady from Facebook Marketplace and she was trying to sell her beanies and I asked her if she would like to donate them and she donated more than a few. She donated many, 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 many of which most I donated to the processing center. But this one I kept. It was a brand new beanie and the tag was in, in the thing, so uh, the cover, and so it was free for me. But I thought he was perfect for this box. Okay, and then he has a matchbox. This is actually a matchbox car train. This is Thomas the Tank. And he just has a little pair of tissues. That's kind of a little filler from Dollar Tree. 
They come, I think, three and three or six in a pack. I haven't purchased them in a long time. He has a pair of a set of crayons. These are 67 cents. These are the jumbo crayons from Walmart. Let's see. He has these are from Dollar Tree. It's a pair of utensils. Those are a dollar. And he has this Thomas and Friends jumbo coloring book. And I think I actually got this at Michael's. I think I had a hard time finding a Thomas the Tank coloring book. I don't know why. It used to be so popular when my kids were younger, but. And then he has a nice cuddly uh, fleece lovey that I make. And these, this is just, um, I don't know, like three quarters of a yard of fabric. And I'm not a seamstress, trust me, but they're very easy to make. I get the material when it's on sale at Joanne Fabrics, and I just do a running stitch or sometimes a, a, a zigzag stitch around the edge. And it has little trains on it. I thought that was really cute. Something he can cuddle with. He also has this train whistle, and I get these from Oriental Trading. They are right now $9.99 a dozen, which makes them $0.83 cents each. He has my personal card, my personal letter to a special boy. And I do handwrite my letters. Oh, he has these big train stickers. I found these at Dollar Tree. So I thought these were pretty cool. And he has some school supplies. I have them all wrapped up because some are sharpened. And he has um, a Ticonderoga and then some fun pencils and then two click pens in this little, I put tissue on the outside to keep them from messing anything else up in the box. He has a red washcloth. And in here is a little um, drawstring bag that I stenciled. And inside, it's a car on the front. Something that he can keep his cars in. He has two little cars in here. A little red truck. And a little blue race car. Okay, he has this um, Thomas train. It comes with a little caboose section here, or coal, I'm not sure. I'm not a train expert. But they do connect, and it does turn on. There it is. And it does move. So there's batteries inside. I don't think you can see that in my. Let's move everything back. And then in here is a, um, a a small screwdriver with a note on it to if they need to replace the batteries. And these are instructions. And then he has two pairs of Paw Patrol underwear. And he has some soap. And in his soap container, he has little instructions I got from Blessings in a Shoebox on clipping toenails and a toenail clipper inside. You can see that. I get the containers from Dollar Tree when they're three in a package for a dollar. He has two Thomas the Train toothbrushes. These are from Dollar Tree. He has a half composition book. I got these at Walmart at end of year school clearance. And inside his composition book, he has some Mickey stickers, some farm stickers, oh, all kinds. 
Dr. Seuss, and I kind of just stuck them in the composition book. Then on the bottom he has a beach ball. I got these for 10 cents at Walmart at the end of summer clearance. These are just extra pencils that are falling in there and he has an eraser. He has a pencil case. I got these on Amazon. And he has a pencil sharpener, a closed pencil sharpener. And he has, of course, for a train box, he has a red bandana. I'm trying to include bandanas and face masks in all my boxes this year. And he has extra batteries for his train. And these are sealed, because they should be sealed if not taped on both sides. And that is my shoe box for boy two to four. My train shoe box. Thanks for watching. I hope to do another one soon, and I hope you'll come back. If you like it, please comment and um, hit the like button. And I also want to tell you something that I'm doing, which I probably should have told you in the beginning of the video, but um, if, you're, if you've watched this far, now you'll know. I'm going to do a pencil pack giveaway. And that's for, um, because I'm just so passionate about pencil packs. Anybody who watches the video and comments below, and you have to live in the US, unfortunately, I'm sorry for my UK friends, um, if you comment below, I will randomly pick one of the comment persons, persons who comments, and send you out a mini startup kit for packing pencils for filler for Operation Christmas Child at the Processing Center. Just some extra goodies, share the love, I have lots of extras, and I thought it might be a fun way to interact with everybody. So just comment below, and um, in about a week or two, I'll just pick a random, put everybody's name in a hat and pick somebody and I will send you a little box of supplies. So again, thanks for watching. This is Denise, I'll see you next time. Bye for now.